this is Jelly and welcome to a new video and in this video today we will be making two automatic furnace systems on my storage area in my storage area so it would be nice and handy we would literally go here plonk all the items in come back a little bit later and they will all be smelted which is great so we just need to extend this by two on both sides we did making two for to make it even because <laughs> why not and they're three by three so it's a pretty small i do not see any point in me having a massive industrial super smelter because there's no need i'd probably only ever end up using two of the furnaces at a time so might as well go and have two furnaces down here okay so it's time to get building with all the redstone and all the hard stuff i've only done one side to clear out all the space here and i think i recall how to do this so you only get if i remember correctly one furnace but that's fine because you can just go away and it will all be good and now the bit where i hate we have to put a hopper's facing like this it's so annoying oh but i didn't well oh oh okay that's good now I need to go and put my chest on top. I think so anyway. Now I, I feel like I have a really it feels like I'm coming down with a cold. I've had a really sore throat and a really croaky throat and if you can't tell I don't know my voice sounds a bit weird. And it's probably one of the nice and worrying things when you try to make commentaries because you try not to cough and every time you go into cough you have to go and try and press the pause button and when you like you have to make the cut seem as if you didn't cut at all, which is really hard. Okay now that's all you do then i need to go onto the redstone wall in fact i think i need to go and move this one back mm. get damn it okay that's going to be a problem because i don't know how i'm going to, be able to hide the chest from the top unless we just let the chest just chill there i don't know but let's go and do the little redstone clock for it which shouldn't be too hard even for me if there's enough room this is ah oh, it connects to that ah oh. That sucks, but oh well. And I don't put. I'm gonna go and put three Peters in now because I can't. I won't be able to get back. Get freaking. I can't jump, can I? I'm just gonna. Oh, I should remove this roof. Yes, yeah, something like that. It's gonna do that. And. Do. Two. Two. Running into a block. Uh huh. And then you go. Boop. I need to do the same kind of thing along here and it's another repeater if I recall correctly and then you do something like this uh, something like that anyway <laughs> ta da and the redstone is done now we need to go and see if it works which I'm just going to put this in for now and then go and find something to smelt I think the only thing I have to smelt at the moment is this so we'll go with this for now I have a load of coal blocks we get, we go and get those in a second I'm also going to put a switch in somewhere so I can turn it off because okay, coal goes in this chest um, cobblestone goes in this chest I can just come out of this chest and let's let the magic work okay so this one here is going to be a test to see if I can remember how to do it completely <laughs> which is uh, I'm not feeling very hateful considering I've already forgotten it no, okay I remembered I remembered and I do something a wee bit like that and I need another hopper I think have I done it right no this is not cheap I've already cheated really haven't I <laughs> I need another hopper anyway I underestimated the amount of hoppers I would needed for some reason I only thought I needed a free per one but luckily we've made a load which is great okay uh, uh. go and put these two here if I can get rid of that shoo madman okay anyway 1.8 should be coming out on Tuesday and everybody has like loads of amazing projects that are like gonna be made and stuff like pipe is gonna be doing king of a ladder <laughs> that's the only person's project that I remembered but these people I bet it's, the server's gonna be quite active that day I don't know I just have a feeling I'm just gonna have a sneaky peek at that yes I feel like I'm doing good and you can pop in the chests yeah they go there <laughs> many brain fart right there mm -hmm. yes that is great okay now here's a redstone for hard part well 
key block here redstone torch there and why did I just hear a that shouldn't have made a click but oh well <laughs> yeah I'm not going to trust that because I know how much of a redstone noob I am and let's go up here put in the two the two the two the place god damn it what's wrong with you woman okay place yes and I'm gonna is that two ticks yeah it's two is that three ticks nope that's just me being a noob again <laughs> not an uncommon sight mm -hmm. I also want to make a guardian farm it may take a wee while to make a guardian farm because it involves quite a lot of uh, digging big holes <laughs> well most farms that I've seen so far has involved digging big holes I haven't seen any tiny farms which you never get really a tiny mob farm like I've always wanted to make a gold farm but I cannot make up my mind what kind of gold farm I'd want there's so many different ones you know I could have another portal gold farm. I could have a gold farm with loads of pistons, and that's what I can think of off from my head because it's probably actually only two. Because I, I didn't mean like I mean designs. So there's different farm designs. I mean, could I, I could have one big never portal. I could have loads of small never portals. <laughs> Lots of choice. Okay, two. Oh my god, I think I've actually remembered this. I've actually remembered this. Please work. Oh my god, I think I've worked. Yes, I've remembered it. Yes, yeah, screen high five. Okay, so I spent ages trying to find a way to cover the chest, and in the end I was like, you know what, just make the size too thick, and it actually wasn't that bad, because I had tried flower pots and all of that, but then I realised that I couldn't eat from the chest with them dirty for it, because it's a full block, so I tried loads of other slabs, tried to put like, um, cobble slabs all the way around here, I tried putting stone brick slabs around here, it looked horrible disgusting to be honest so i was like yeah just go and do this and it it looks okay i suppose it looks a lot more bulkier but at least i have my furnaces now which is actually pretty cool okay so i've just been doing a bit of mining you know haste to efficiency five just clear out this area i've got some diamonds and i've got a load of cobblestone because i need the cobblestone because i was really really running out so i've got quite a bit i think i don't know how i'm going to transport this up really i should have brought an ender chest down here so we're going to take this all up and i'll be with you guys in a second okay so just done some enchanting at the ender ender and i've got a load of nice picks i've got an f Filled with okay, we're just going efficiency for fortune two. That isn't really that good, but I want efficiency four so I can get fortune fives. Fortune fives, <laughs> efficiency fives. Um, I already had that. <laughs> efficiency five and breaking three. Obviously, I combine stuff that. Efficiency four, which is handy for making efficiency fives. Um, efficiency four, fortune three, efficiency five and breaking three. And silk switch one efficiency four. I also have a couple of others that I put in my ender chest. But anyhow, I've been getting some efficiency five bricks because I want to make a slime farm. It makes sense if 1.8 comes out. There is one at spawn which I'm gonna update so it's able to work in 1.8 because um, bold slime farms won't really be able to work if you kill them by water because slimes can now swim up so you can't really drown them. But what you can do is you can use iron golems or cactus. I do have a lot of cactus and I was thinking about using cactus, I was like nah, I'm just gonna go for iron golems because it's just so much fun of watching them being beaten up to death, so you know why not. There's a slime chunk by my base, which I'm gonna work on this one first before updating them when it's spawn because I want one for my personal use at first. Done quite a bit of um well I haven't done loads of layers. I I've I've done quite a bit-ish, well not really, it hasn't really taken me that long with my efficiency 5 and haste, and haste 2, but I ran into a mine shaft, wasn't expecting it, got completely obliterated by cavey spiders, but luckily I managed to go and get a spawner, as you can probably tell, that was like when I was in the first two layers or whatever <laughs> which is good so i need to go and light up all the caves around here when i'm done i was using tnt to start off with i had about a stack of tnt um but then i ran out and i do have loads of gunpowder just for sand i didn't have and to be honest i didn't really see a point in me going to get it it probably didn't really save me that much time anyway because the haste three is doing it all for haste three um the haste two and the efficiency five is doing it all for me which is great you should say so let's go ahead and show you this if anything i really need to do is the storage area and a way to get into the storage area because the way i get in right now isn't very practical and the spawn rates 
won't be very good at the moment because basically what I need to do is light up my case which I haven't done at the moment and obviously this is my killing method and down here is my storage area which is not very efficient at the moment it's just a few chests and some, some hoppers to um you know to go and get all the slime box that I do get now which won't be many because it's not all my caves lit up actually well I've lit up some of the caves but there's, there's loads around here that I need to go and light up which will probably be a whole project in itself but anyway guys, I'm going to go and finish up episode here, so bye.